Alright guys, welcome back to the episode of Assassin's Creed Odyssey, and this time we're playing a mission called Speak No Evil. You have to interrogate Midos, the elder priest at the guest house. And he's right there. Alright, here we go, the guest house. They'll be watching for me. Oh shit. I need to be careful. Okay. I gotta be careful here, then I gotta be careful, I guess. What the hell's going on back there? I don't care. There's the leader, there's the leader. There's two captains here, okay. Okay, now it's just you. Come on. Come on. Give me that shield. Give me that shield. Bitch. That's it. Got his ass. Give me that loot. Give me this chest. Perfect. Alright, let's go talk to him then. And you must be Midon. He doesn't speak. So I've heard. I'm here to find out why. Chrysis did this to him. Uh -huh. I thought he did this to himself. To prove his loyalty to her. Now, why would Chrysis want an elder priest to cut out his tongue? Midon is a caring, generous man. I want answers from him, not you. Tell me about the Spartan woman and her baby. He can only answer yes or no. The Spartan woman, was her name Mirini? They said she had a baby with her. Was it hers? The baby was close to death when they arrived. Midon prayed for its life. You saved the child. No. He did everything he could, but the baby was badly wounded. Did she tell you where she was going? Do all sanctuary priests take their servants to bed? I am not his servant. We share a sacred bond. A sacred? Right. I know why Chrysis made you cut out your tongue. The night my mother brought my brother here, you and your priests left him for dead. And Chrysis didn't like you telling the story. That's not what happened! What do you know? You're too young to have been there. He told me the story many times before that witch stole his voice. He tried to save the baby, did everything he could.
I don't believe you. Dead? How can my baby be dead? I don't know what to tell you. You were lucky he survived as long as he did. That, that fall was devastating. <laughs> my baby! My baby! <laughs> Listen, there's nothing we can do for you anymore. You'd best be on your way. Ray is here. Right? <laughs> They're gone. They're both gone. He wept for that Spartan woman so far from home, her baby barely recognizable, hardly breathing. Tell me, please. I need to know. Not even Apollo could save the child. Nidon told me how the Spartan woman wept, held the baby in her arms, sang to him, before finally leaving him to the gods. Chrysis took the baby, didn't she? And she made you cut out your tongue to hide the truth. Where is Chrysis? There is an altar, where people offer their sick babies to be healed. This is where she took the child. Find it near the statue of Apollo Maleatas, and you'll find Chrysis. People come to this sanctuary to heal. But I come here and find people dying without hope, priests without tongues, and babies left with an insane woman. <laughs> My mother was a fool to trust any of you. I'm going to find Chrysis, and she's going to pay for what she's done. Hush, my child. May Ira bless oh, our she's a sacred 16. family. Okay, okay, she's a good. Where is she? Which one is she? Which one is she? Uh, do, 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 do. Is that her? Yep, that's her. So Chrysis is the key to finding my mother. I must find this altar Speak of Apollo Speak no Maleatas. evil complete. And with this, I'm going to end this episode right here. Like, subscribe, share, and comment if you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys next episode. Peace out, everybody.